Hey everybody, um, this video has been a long time coming, and it's been a very difficult video to make. Partially, it's also just fueled by a lot of things. I'm not feeling well. Uh, can't already tell, um, I've been having a lot of throat problems today, and I probably have strep throat, so that's just fun. <laughs> but it's also just... I want to kind of have a bit of a difference, like, not just changing the logo, but also kind of just updating the style of the channel, and I'm going to, around August, um, a lot of things are about to change, uh, most of all the streams and most of all the content, besides regular videos, which you'll be seeing a lot more of, um, will now be put into their own pri little playlist that you guys can watch so it's less crowded. But also, I'm going to be taking longer breaks. Now, this is fueled by a lot of people saying this, and also just because it's fueled by a lot of things. Uh, envy, uh, frustration, anger, uh, and also just some stuff behind the scenes. A lot of emotional stuff, and a lot of stuff just me struggling um, to really come up with like like trying to find um you know just a niche pin uh for myself a unique one and like i said on stream this has been something that's been a long time coming and a lot of people have suggested you know like i should take a break i've been uploading constantly but the thing is i kind of go with this todd mcfarlane you know if nobody else is going to do it i'm going to do it myself type of philosophy and that's kind of why I've tried to get into other platforms and see how well stuff does. Um, which, uh, somewhat good <laughs> and somewhat just eh. And it kind of has sucked, uh, just seeing and stuff like that. And like I said on stream, um, after a certain point, sometimes the compliments, uh, I wouldn't say they feel fake. But sometimes it gets to a point where it's just kind of like telling someone what you want them to hear. Because, like, for instance, lately, the reason why um, some of the streams have been lack thereof or just things have been kind of slowed down somewhat, uh, I still upload daily. Because I thought I could do this full time. I thought, because here's the thing. This is not a you guys thing. This was a my problem that I realized and I came into stumbling. Like I basically fell flat on my face. And I can admit this. And this is not your guys' fault. This is my fault. I had this expectation that if I started YouTube, I would go and succeed immediately. Which, <laughs> somewhat I did. Uh, which I do appreciate. 172 subscribers. Um, but ever since, you know, I hit that little milestone, you know, it's just been stagnant, uh, very stagnant or static, very just, I don't upload to like a consistent schedule. I don't, <laughs> I don't really do things the way I wanted to do. Like I wanted to do stuff and like due to a lot of limitations, whether it's technical problems, uh, just stuff behind the scenes that you guys don't see, um, just in general stuff going on that, you know, I don't want to completely share. It's just been very difficult. <laughs> um, it's been like a big hurdle and I can admit my fault. I, I had this expectation and I thought I would just jump feet first into the pool and I would take off. Like, like, that's what I thought, and I think that's where I fell flat on my face. I thought, and that's, like, at in some point I did, and I was, like, I was riding the high for a bit, and then, like, then it went back down low. <laughs> and and it was, like, a, a, a reality kick in the ass where I realized, oh, shit, you know. And I think it was also somewhat, you know, the whole hater thing, even though they shouldn't, I shouldn't have gave them too much attention, you know, some things they said actually stuck with me. And, you know, I know that, you know, I shouldn't, you know, be affected by that stuff. And I know it sounds petty. And I know it sounds childish. But there was some things that were said that were kind of effective and made me think. 
it made me think because, you know, I know some people, like I know some of you guys were very complimentary, very, you know, and I do appreciate all the, um, you know, things you guys said. I do appreciate that. But there was, you know, there was points where I was like, you know, what if they're not wrong? And I know that's like, if you, I know I shouldn't second guess myself and I know I shouldn't, you know, take what someone says and run with it because they're just hating. They're just running their mouth and stuff like that. But here's the thing. When it comes to like the voice recordings and just me, you know, talking, how often did not you guys actually like hearing my voice and hearing me talk about stuff? You know, how often did not you guys stop by the streams? You know, how often do not you like you do get the notifications? Do you you know do you guys like or you know how often that do you actually guys like what I'm doing? See that's the thing. And I and I know that if the fact that not everyone's gonna like what I do. <laughs> not everyone is going to enjoy everything I do, and that's perfectly fine. I completely understand that. I'm not one of those people that's entitled. I know that I'm not going to, like, be the next Markiplier, be the next Jack Septi. I'm not going to be. But the, also, but what I did expect is at least I would get, uh, I, I, what I expected, and this was m personally on me, and this is my fault for expecting it, is that I would take off. I would, you know, because I had all these creative ideas and all these things. But then I also had the, I what I didn't foresee was all these other little hurdles that were rigged against me. Whether it's technical problems, whether it's just content in general been, being very sporadic. And and that was the thing, and that's what's increased this burnout. That's what it's made me hate doing this anymore. And it's made it less fun for me. And this is on me because, and it's not on you guys. So if you guys are watching this, you know... It's not on you. It's on me. It's on me because I thought, you know, with all the art videos or the gaming stuff, like more people would be more interested, more people would watch, and I would have like maybe more people sticking around and watching the whole thing and stuff. Now, there's times where certain people, they'll do that, and it's great, and it's always nice for me to see. But like, it's always, like, there's always a bit of envy when I see like other people that were below like when they were at the same level as me but now they're top now they're at uh, like k subscribers or they're at this or they're getting donations and it's like for me it's very hard it's like a tough pill to swallow because it's like it's it's a little bit of a human old trait and i can admit this this is on me and i shouldn't decourage anyone and i'm and i'm not in a way, discouraging anyone for growth because they were they ju work just as hard. And don't get me wrong; don't take that as that's what I'm saying. What I'm saying is it's very hard for me because you know there's points where I feel like I just want to give up and I just want to quit and I want to stick my head in the sand. And there's other times where it's like, no, fuck that. So it's very hard and it's a very narrow road to. Put, it's like it's a very in between road to push through because you can't tell what people actually want from you and like and i'm trying the, my best to like do videos that i'm happy with but the thing is half the time the videos i or the stuff i'm putting out i'm not happy with it and that's the difficult thing and that's the thing that makes me so upset inside is that i'm not happy with the content i'm putting out because half the time Either I can see all the flaws in it, I can see that the audio is crap, the thumbnail is garbage, people are not, they don't really tune in, they don't like it, so it's like, what is the point? Perfect example. When I've tried doing walkthroughs on the channel, half the time the walkthroughs didn't get as much attention, and I actually sat down and watched my own walkthrough, and I realized the audio is crap, <laughs> the editing is garbage the the thumbnail was decent and i was just realizing all these little things all these little problems 
and I know, like, I shouldn't, I, like, it's, you know, as a person, you're always critical of yourself. But in fairness, for me, it's very discouraging to notice how all these little things. And then when you finally get somebody that gives you a reality check, you know, it was it hurtful? Yes. But was it a little bit of a reality check? I know that not everyone was going to like my stuff, but that's not what the reality check was. It was the reality check of, you know, even the most hurtful things can actually be the, the silently true things, if you know what I'm saying. Um, and that's been the hardest thing lately. That's kind of why I've really streamed less. Um, I've done more art stuff, which have, you know, gotten some bit of attention and then some bits not. And that's really been the hardest thing. Lately, I just wanted to see if I could try to see where I, where I can go. And lately, it really hasn't been going anywhere. And that's been the difficult pill to swallow and the difficult thing. And, and it's mostly due to my own um, pride where I thought things would, you know, finally maybe to get, go back up. And I was wrong. And I can admit that. And that is not on you guys. That is on me. So what I'm going to be doing... <laughs> um, first thing is, I'm going to try to feel better because, you know, you can probably slightly tell, but it's, you know, very if. Um, I'm going to be taking longer. You know, I want to make sure the content I'm putting out, the content I'm doing, is actually worth a damn. It's stuff that you guys want to see. It's what you guys want to watch. And it's also, like... The quality of it is not crap. And I think that's been the most difficult thing is that sometimes it's been the quality of the content I've been putting out has been god awful. And I, and like nobody said it, but I was watching a lot of the stuff and like whether it's the camera work, whether it is just the video quality, whether it's the editing. It's just, like, very everywhere. And the content I'm also putting out is very sporadic. It's not, you know, A, B, C, D. And I think that's where I've, and that's also where I stumbled. And I've, and I kind of can admit that. And, like, I'm being brutally honest with you guys, you know. This is probably, you guys will probably tell me, if they, no, you're wrong. No, no, no. No, don't spare my feelings, okay? <laughs> you know, like, sometimes the, the honesty is the best policy. And for right now, I want to focus on making content and videos, more likely than not videos, whether it's a short or whether it's whatever, that I'm actually happy with. Whether it's stuff like that. And most often than not, if I don't tag anybody, <laughs> um, which I can, I've can, i noticed lately, if I'm not tagging certain people, you know, a lot of the videos have not gotten a whole lot of attention. Like, a lot of the content is still in stagnant. Uh, if I'm not tagging certain people because of, like, the whole thing of, like, how much, how many of you have the bell turned on? <laughs> That's the thing. You know, I'm pretty sure. And I also, I, I know that some people, some of you is like, you have your own lives and you have your own stuff. Your, your life do not evolve around me. I'm not saying they do. I'm not saying that. I'm just pointing out something that I've noticed. So what to cut to the chase is that I, what's going to happen around November is we're going to actually form like a schedule, which I said I was going to do in the past, completely ditched it because <laughs> I just kind of forgot about it and kind of just went back from stat static. But this time I'm going to stick to it. Um, Saturdays at nine, I'm going to be doing streaming, you know, whether it's an art stream or it's a gaming stream, that's what I'm going to be doing. 
the around Mondays uh, or Tuesdays, Wednesdays or Thursdays or Fridays, those will probably be regular video days. But here's the thing. Those will be taking a while to edit. So what I'm going to be doing is for the next month, because I also need to feel better, I'm going to be editing. I'm going to be setting up certain videos. I will be keeping you guys up to date on progress and stuff like that. So actually pay attention to the community post because that is what I'm going to be using. And also follow me on other platforms um, and share the videos and what have you. I always say this stuff, but I think it falls on deaf ears. So I'm going to say it again. Please share the videos. It, I know that not every video is going to be something people will like, but... If I can get more people interested and more people coming to the channel and stuff like that, that allows me to grow a little bit more. And here's the thing. Around November, I will be going to a more simpler name, being RMX Art and Games. Simple as that. Sorry, um, lately, um, it's I wanted to try something different and I wanted to have a simpler name. You know, just simple, cut to the chase, la di da di da And personally, I want to just refocus on getting the channel to a more stabler groove, work on thumbnails, working on just updating everything. <laughs> you know, making the channel more accessible, more professional, and making sure the video quality and the stuff like that is stuff that you guys want to, uh, you know, you guys will like and stuff like that. And, you know, lately, a lot of the videos, like, like I have barely uploaded a single, like, after the few, some of them did very well, and I was happy about it, and a lot didn't. And so what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be taking a break from streaming, I'm going to be taking a break from shorts, and what I'm going to be doing is editing. And I have a lot of different ideas for certain videos. And I'm going to make sure that the videos in question are going to be with uh, other people. Now, here's the second thing that I was going to mention. I am going to start doing more partnered, more collab-based videos with you know, friends or subscribers if you guys are interested. Or just stuff in general. And I'm also going to make sure that the videos in question are more professional. And also, just in general, I want to focus on making sure that the content I produce is I'm, ha I'm, I'm happy with. I want to do a mixture of art, and I want to do a mixture of games. But I also want to have a slight snud in for doing, you know game ideas or slight audio things just freshen things up get some different stuff so you will see you know one-off things like a one-shot audio thing or a one-shot gaming idea or a part one or two or three to that but yeah so i want to have something that's for everybody and that's what i'm going to do so hopefully you guys enjoy um, I'm going to try to focus on making sure that the channel is more accessible, more professional. Uh, I'm going to private a few uh, things um, that are old. And also, I'm going to unlist a lot of things and put them into playlists. So, this way the videos, or just content in general, is less sporadic and less stuff like that. So what I'm going to be doing is that if you guys want to have access to uh, certain things like watch rewatch live streams or rewatch different content um like whether it's shorts or stuff everything will now be in a playlist except regular videos. That'll be starting around October and in general a lot of changes will be occurring on the channel. Not just a name change, not just everything. Everything is going to be changed 
from the ground up for multiple reasons um, in general that I don't want to disclose in this video. Um, but yeah, uh, sorry. It There's just a lot of things that I want to do. Like I know a lot of people, like Beta especially, she mentioned it before. You know, I've always had a lot of problems, you know, like I'm not feeling well or stuff like that. I should take breaks or something. And that's what I aim to do, but I don't have the same luxuries as everybody else. So for me, it's a lot different and I work at a different pace. So that's why I'm doing this a lot more because it's not just a hobby. It, I want to make it just like a side, more of a side gig. I wouldn't say a career, but a side gig. And maybe I can get a bit of money out of it. <laughs> so that's been the main thing. And that's been the hardest thing for me. So what's going to happen now? Because um, also YouTube has not recommended uh, my channel. Uh, they stopped recommending it a couple months back. And that's been something I have not figured out why. So that's another reason why I want to update the channel. And do more content that I'm happy with. <laughs> so yeah. Um, so for me. That's what's going to be going on. So yeah. Until next time guys. Peace out and bye bye.